This one is really way cheap. I'm not quite sure if this is the original one. Dreidel Naturals Vitamin C Serum. Does it really work? Is it worth it? Is it advisable to use on hot places? Do you guys want to know what my real and honest opinion about this product? Please keep on watching. channel it's Jay-Z here the Catfishes Lady back at it again with another video and for today's video we're going to be doing a product review of the Natal Naturals Vitamin C Serum I decided to do a product review about this since there's not much reviews about it if you're going to google it or on YouTube like literally nothing there's one but it's in Arabic and I don't find it very helpful no <laughs> which was only uploaded by username called Dubai Amazon Wholesale, something like that. So yeah, I decided to do a product review about this, hoping this will be helpful for you too if you're going to buy it on Amazon. First things first, where can you buy this? I bought this from Amazon. I bought this from Amazon, the price ranges from 38 to 50 T or sometimes it jumps to 60 Like If you're a loyal Amazon customer, then you will know the prices on Amazon that sometimes just goes... <laughs> Oh, it just goes up and then sometimes it just goes down. There are lots of sales on Amazon, that's what I can say. As for me, I just keep it in my cart and then wait until the price goes down. Yeah, that's how you save money. This is the packaging. Wait, it's, it's in a box. Do you want me to put it back in the box? Or I should? I don't know. Anyway, I'll put it back in the box. Oh my gosh, my hands are long and it bothers me. Like, I'll just hold it like this. Jadel Naturals Vitamin C Serum. Serum, serum, I don't know what it's called really, how you pronounce it. I may be pronouncing it wrong, but I'm going with serum. I stand with serum. <laughs> okay, but first, what is a vitamin C serum? A vitamin C serum is a powerful antioxidant that fights fine lines by stimulating collagen. Where is that noise coming from? Brightens your complexion by blocking excess pigmentation and protects your skin from damaging free radicals. Brightens skin for youthful glow, strong ability for antioxidant, fade out dark spots, evens out skin tone and texture, boost collagen production for beautiful skin. This is a 30ml bottle. I hope you guys can see it properly. Okay, ingredients. I remember I'm not going to read the ingredients anymore. I'm going to post it down below since there are, I'm pretty sure, there are lots of words in here that I have never seen or heard before. Let's stutter again. As you have seen in my previous videos, it's not good. I'm just going to open it for you and you guys have already seen this since I just put it back in the box. Anyway, so here she is. Although strange. From what I remember when I buy serums, well, this is actually the first serum that I've tried, but the first serum doesn't look like this. I believe it has a different packaging. And there is a paper inside. I don't know what you call the paper inside, but you remember when you're going to buy some medicines and stuff? There is a paper inside. I think it's the instruction or something, but this one doesn't have, so I'm not quite sure if this is the original one, but I've been using this for quite some time now, like two months since they changed the packaging. Nothing bad happened. I didn't see any side effects. I use this once a day in the morning, perfect time to put vitamin C serum on. And also I put it after doing some treatments like when I shave my face or when I, what do you call the other one? <laughs> when I steam my face and any other things that I do on my face when I'm bored. I just use three drops of this on my face, like one, two, three, and some on my neck. Ow, that hurts. I've been using this for like 10 months now. I don't know, I lost count. And there are no side effects on my face. So I'm going to post a disclaimer for this video. works for you may not work for me and the product that works for me may not work for you we all have different skin types we all have different opinions and experiences on some products so please respect them respect thank you i'm using this for 10 months now more than or less than 10. i decided to do a product review but then i barely remember what my face looks like or how it feels like without the serum on it so then i decided to film a video of me putting a toner but not a toner why did i just say toner Please, um, if you haven't watched my previous video yet, I also did a review of this Thayer's Rose Petal Witch Hazel Toner. Please do watch it if you haven't. I'm going to link it up there. I know, on this side. No, I'm not quite sure. I think it's on. <laughs> Putting a serum on this side of my face and leave this one alone. No, applying anything, if that makes sense. I'm going to show you guys a clip of me earlier and I'm going to be back later for an update.
doesn't look so I'll get back to you later guys and I will show you I'll give you an update about it so Vitamin C serum combines the high quality vitamin and high, high, high hyaluronic acid. Hyaluronic acid, from what I know, your skin doesn't really absorb it. Like, it doesn't stay in your face for the long run. When you apply it and then you wash it, it washes off. That's what I know. Next thing I know about hyaluronic acid, hyaluronic acid. See, this is why I don't like eating in heat. It's only beneficial if you're living in cold places. But we are currently living in a desert, so it's not really advisable. I don't advise you guys to use it, but I use it. I love this product. I'm supposed to say that later on by the final verdict, but I said it already, so. <laughs> so it's almost 11 now. I'm going to show you guys the time. And I'm here to give you guys an update. So here's where I put the serum on. And here's where I didn't. Okay, as you guys can see, there's not much of a difference. Like, I'm not seeing any difference at all. Yeah, okay, maybe because I've been using this for months now. It claims to improve your skin complexion. I can say that yes, it did. Lightening and moisturizing, yeah. It brightened up my skin. You should start putting on skincare when you have reached 20. It's kind of like the best time to take care of your skin. There's not much of a difference, but it's not for it. Also, I would like to give you guys a simple reminder if you're going to use a new product, not apply it on your face directly. You need to apply it on some parts of your body. For me, I put it at the back of my hand or sometimes I put it on my forearm. So I'm just going to test it for like 24 hours. And if my skin doesn't have any negative reactions, then I might put it on my face. And when I do put it on my face, I don't usually put it like every day. I tend to leave one or two days gap in between. So if there will be negative reactions, then it won't be that drastic on my face. If I'm going to recommend it, I'm not quite sure if I'm going to recommend it to you guys, but I love this product so much. I just don't want to recommend it to you guys since we are in the desert. Then I don't think you should use it. I'm not advising you guys to use it since this place is so damn hot. Or if you're going to use this product, I might suggest that you use it during winter. Use it at your own risk. I have noticed a big difference. When it was raining that time, I feel like my skin was literally glowing. Okay, for the pros and cons of this product, the pro of this one is I can say that it's way cheaper than the other serums because all the other serums that I've searched are more than 100 dirhams or like way higher than 100, it's more than 200. This one is really way cheaper. There are other expensive serum brands, but I can say that this works the same. I can also say that this has helped me with my skin problem. I don't really have a skin problem, but if you're new to my channel, I have a very dry skin. For the cons of this product, as I mentioned earlier, this doesn't have this paper inside or the ingredients. For me, that is very important. When I bought Cetaphil and other skincare products, they have this paper inside that this one doesn't have. It's just this. That's one thing. Also, the second thing is the manufacturer is not stated in this box. Or I have not checked it properly, but as far as I know, it's not stated in here. If you guys would like to see more, more of this, I'm sorry, what? <laughs> That's it for this video, guys. I hope you like it, and if you do, please give it a thumbs up. And I hope you guys have learned something from this video. I hope you find this helpful. Also, you can contact them at www.jailnaturals.com. I'm going to post it down here. Yeah. If you guys have some questions, reactions, comments, or suggestions, please feel free to leave a comment down below. I'd be delighted to answer your questions. That's it for today's video, guys. I hope you like this video. And if you do, please give it a thumbs up. And if you would like to see more of this in here, more from this, then please subscribe to my channel if you haven't subscribed yet. And also don't forget to hit the notification bell button so you'll be updated on all the videos I'm going to I love you all and I'll see you all in my next video. Bye!